morning, everybody. Well, my throat and ear condition has hit me yet again. can barely talk. But it's not going to stop me from doing a live feed in about an hour. Live stream that uh, we're going to show off the first drive setup. We're going to take general steps into all the new features, all the new content, and everything that's been tested. Not just throwing a bunch of stuff on a drive and going, look, you've got this stuff that you can't play. But you've got this stuff. So I get two questions asked every week, the most prominent. Number one, I'm trying to get close to the mic, so. Number one is, where can I buy a cabinet? Well, I am talking with someone today who's been around a very long time who might be able to help the 40-plus emails I have. Number two is, are you still building machines? I never stopped building machines. I just stopped advertising I was building machines. Um... On average year, I would average no less than 350 to 400 machines a year. And these are all custom builds. Now, up 2021, I shipped 521 machines. And starting this year, I decided to trail it back a little bit due to the hardware, the pricing, the availability. But I still had a connection for some, you know, some type of machines that... I personally feel and I've tested, actually I have two of these, uh, these Ryzen 7s going into the cabinets that I've got coming and I'm very pleased with it and it keeps the price affordable and powerful rigs. Now I don't build cheap machines, I don't build low end machines, I'll use, off this, you know, I'll use green label hardware, I use mid to level hardware, mid to high end hardware, simply because it makes more sense, more practical sense. I have to maintain your warranty. I'm not going to give you something cheap. It's going to be a headache later on. Since I charge a flat rate fee anyway, I still come in much less than machines off the shelf, half the price. So let's take a look at these are, I have a 12 by 12 in the other room. And so these are, uh, they, that room is full. I have even my pool table here. That's 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And so basically, all these builds, except for this one down here, um, they, they all average right around 15 bucks. This one was about 13 something. For example, NZXT H510 case. Um, usually try to go with a Gigabyte, a uh, MSI a motherboard, uh, AS Rock. There's good, they proved very well and good as well. Um, going with the um, these were Ryzen 7 5700Gs, 24 gigs of RAM. They all have themed extension cables. Um, Anywhere from 500 to 750 watt uh, gold plus power supplies, 256 gig NVMe, uh, 14 terabyte Seagate, and 240 millimeter closed loop water cooler. Now, why am I starting to advertise these again? Because um, I'm still doing pretty high end rigs for those that. Uh, who contact me. I just haven't shown any off. We're going to change that. It's because I get a call at least once or twice a week from someone who has paid twelve, thirteen hundred dollars $1,300 for a legacy machine and they're having trouble getting anything to work. Well, hell yeah, you're getting, you paid 1300 bucks for an Intel i5-3650, which is a 4th gen i5. It was legacy whenever you opened the box. I think you, you know, misread the, uh, I mean, he misheard you. He probably said, I want to be a legend. He's like, oh, you want legacy hardware. That's cool. These are $50 machines, and they're being passed on to work as, um, you know, 12, 1300 bucks. You just saw what brand new high-end builds are coming, you know, I'm charging for. These two had the sending. You know, I'm out of sending guns now, but these two got my last sendings. So, um, I'm going to make it very well known again that uh, I'm building the machines. It'd be nonsense to go anywhere else. 
I, honestly, I mean, I hope you don't, but it doesn't. It's your decision. I'm just trying to save you, uh, you know, the headache. It's not trying to confront myself, trust me, because work like this can be stressful. When everybody's saying, hey, my machine gonna come out soon? My machine gonna ship out? And yeah, it's gonna ship out when I get done with it. And so um, having a delay doesn't help much. But what does help is, um, you know, it's very rare that I build two machines the same, but having, what, four here makes it much easier. So I'm going to go grab something to eat, and then we're going to look at eight months of updates.